I already mentioned in my other video, I was going to do a product review on all my FXR gear I bought last year. This uh, review is going to be on the Team FX jacket and the matching bibs. Both these pieces have uh, FXR's uh, flotation assist in it, so that's a really good safety item to have. If you're snowmobiling, obviously you're going to be doing some lake crossings, so you always want to keep safety in mind, and not only is it safer with the flotation, I think it's a lot warmer too. You can check out FXR's uh, videos on how well this flotation assist works. This jacket also features um, windproof zippers. You know, you want to keep all the wind from coming through your jacket on those real cold days or when you're really hot on a mild day, you can open up these zippers and that's actually a uh, part of the venting system in this jacket. There's another vents in the armpits you can open up. And they go all the way around back to the back in the kidney area. So you can open up all those for good ventilation. And there's lots of pockets. There's an uh, inside pocket here for your cell phone. Keep it close to you so you can keep some body heat on it so the batteries you know try and keep the battery and your phone warm when you're out there riding um, it's got the waistbands on the outer shell which features the hydrex layering system it really keeps a lot of the wind and like the moisture out if it's like sleeting or raining a bit or just you know the snow melting on you the inside of the jacket also has this uh, waistband that you can buckle up and keep it tight against your body to keep the wind from coming up under the jacket it's all skirted in there really nice so it really seals off the wind and once again keeps you warm um, more on the front of the jacket, it features these snap buttons, which are really nice. Uh, they're like a magnetic snap button. As well, when you uh, zip the jacket all the way up, you got a nice neck collar that's just the right size. It's not too annoying, it just covers your neck and you can velcro the clothes to keep your neck warm. It fits really good with the helmet line. and. Which brings me to another point, how well this gear is made ergonomically, like it's just so comfortable and it's made, it's made for you to be sitting in the riding position so nothing bunches up or you know once you sit on the machine put your arms out on the handlebars your, your sleeves are the right length because it's all engineered. So over to the back of the jacket uh, we got that nice, well you can see I got the light on my iPhone camera here and you can really see how well the reflective band works on the back for night riding and you know you got your nice FXR logo I just went with this nice black gear that way it'll go with any snowmobile I just decide to purchase so you know you know I just didn't want you know a color that we don't want to be good with the uh, snowmobile I had at the time. So you can actually see more of the reflective bands on it here, here, up on the shoulders. It really lights up really good at night. Uh, they use all high quality. I can't say enough about how good this gear is, how happy I am with it. The quality is second to none. It really is worth the money you pay for it and it's not cheap but nothing in power sports is cheap if you want to play you gotta pay and if you want to stay warm and dry and have a good time and put a lot of hours out there which I do you know we go out for 400 kilometer days so we're we're putting this gear 
through its paces every time we put it on and go out riding it. I can't tell you how much better this gear is than the other brand of gear that I had. It's so much warmer, it's so much more comfortable, it's so much lighter, and the functionality of it, all the pockets, all the thought that goes into it when they make it. Uh, they did an awesome job. I'm so happy with Epic Sarah's products. Uh, we talk a bit about the bibs, same thing. Uh, there's lots of pockets. It's got a two-way zipper in the front for those pit stops along the trail. You know how that goes. Uh, more reflective bands down there on the knees. Um, there's plenty of sizing available. I went with the large uh, short stuff because I'm 5'7". At the time I was a little over 200 pounds now I'm down to 175 so it's gonna be pretty baggy but I'd rather have it a little bit baggier you can you know layer up a bit underneath and it's just more comfortable because like I said when we go riding it's long days out there and you just want to be comfortable that's you don't want it too tight and too restrictive you want it nice and loose and and uh, that helps you know, keep a layer of air in between you and your gear, which keeps you warmer. Um, more on this gear, there's a zipper all the way down the side that you can open up for venting. Uh, the bottom cuffs, you know, they got the, the cuff that goes inside your boot and then the outer layer goes over top of your boot to keep all the snow and wind out. Uh, same thing with these uh, pants, I got the flotation assist in them. Once again, these are the FXR team pants. I believe they're the 2015 gear, or maybe the 2016, I'm not sure. I bought them brand new last year, so maybe it is the 2016 stuff. Um, it keeps you warm, dry, and comfortable. And if you fall through the ice, it's gonna keep you floating. I forget the exact time how long it'll keep you afloat for, but I believe it's like a number of hours. So definitely long enough. Your buddies can help get you out of the water. And not only that, they're supposed to drain really, really fast. If you do go in the water, uh, the water is supposed to exit out of it really fast. Once again, check out the FXR's video on that. They got a really good video testing it in the water. So I'm not gonna do that with my gear because I had to buy it with my own money, but I thought I'd share with you guys how happy I am with it, and I highly recommend making the investment and getting yourself a set, especially if you do ice riding. I do a lot of ice fishing as well as, you know, you come across those lake crossings on the trail, so it's just a little added peace of mind. Uh, it doesn't make you invincible. You always want to use common sense when you're crossing frozen water. You know, read the local signage, see what the trails are posted, and use common sense. But it's always good to be a little extra safe and have, you know, that layer of protection on you at all times. And it also keeps you warm. One other thing with this jacket is the liner that has a flotation in it is actually removable so you can you can take that out if you're you know just riding on a normal day when it's not too cold and you're not gonna be going across water you can take the flotation assist liner out and just use the shell of the jacket and it's still got a layer of insulation in it so you're still gonna be warm as long as you're layered up underneath accordingly if you need a set of gear Go get yourself a set of this stuff. You won't be disappointed. I'm not. Uh, that's why I'm doing this video. Hopefully to uh, spread the word how good it is and help people make a uh, educated decision and their big investment, because it is a big investment. But like I said, FX Air puts a lot of thought, research, and quality products into their gear. So. You get what you pay for and you're getting a quality product that's well engineered. That pretty much wraps up my uh, review on my FXR team jacket and bibs. Got any questions, comments, just leave them down below. 
subscribe to my channel and uh, thanks for watching.